morning YouTube. You're watching Swamp Fox Adventures. I'm Wally. We're still waiting on our Walmart order. We got a delay. We were supposed to pick it up at 10 yesterday. We got a notification at 10 saying it was delayed. We got one at noon saying it was delayed. And we haven't heard anything back since noon yesterday. So I was able to get an order in for some water at Sam's. We're gonna run and pick that up later on. We also have more exciting post office content. Spam fries are done. And now we're just gonna let them chill for a minute. The Sam's order is ready. So we're gonna roll out. We're gonna stop at Simple on the way. Since the Sam's order is ready and we also have to stop at the post office, we're gonna stop at Simple and get some coffee to go. And I'm gonna give them some of those sprouts because I've got way too many. And I know they make a lot of salads and stuff. Looks like there's a walking cane. Yeah. Like a water hose well, I don't know. Here, let's set it up against the fence. That way, somebody dropped it. You know what I'm saying? It looks like a pressure wand. And there's a Sato up here. I might even get out of the car with one of the bigger iguanas I've seen. He's pretty proud of himself. Yeah. Let's see if we can see him. Here, I'll get out. That is a massive iguana. That's a trophy animal. He's probably 12 pounds. So I saw how big he was when the Sato was walking off with it. Oh, we got a car coming. Back on Calle La Villa because we don't want to see any snakes today. It's not looking too terribly busy. We are at Simple for a quick coffee, coffee break. All right, wait. We ran to Simple to get some coffees to go, but I kept running into people that we know. So we ended up hanging out and chilling for a sec. And now we are on the road, headed to Sam's Club. We've arrived at Sam. We've got a little bit more running around and errands to do today than I remembered. Uh, ben has no phone case on his phone and we were able to find one at Walmart and we put it on that order. But of course, that order never showed up. I also need to get keys made for Real Babe's new Highlander because we only have one. So I bought blanks. We're gonna have to take those, get those cut, and then program them ourselves. So I think we're gonna run to Walmart after this, back home, drop all the stuff off, get the blank keys, and then we're gonna run to the mall and maybe doing a little more like screwing around. Um, eventually we'll make it back to the house and start doing some work. I am gonna get those coconuts in the ground. I'm just trying to figure out where I'm gonna put them still. They're having us back up for the water. Gracias. Is it gonna shut? Okay. We're about to pass Serrano's. They're not looking open. Um, I've been waiting anxiously for them to open. I've been really wanting some pizza and they are by far my favorite pizza here on the North Coast. We're back on No Snake Road and it's hot and it's midday. So our chances of seeing a snake are slim to none but then again, we're not gonna see a snake anyways. A Highlander. Yeah, the, the brakes were really, really sensitive and then they just plain locked up. Um, not really sure what's going on right now. 
but we cannot get them to release. What's that? And now we wait. I got a message out to Rolando, see if he could give us a tow today. And he hasn't seen the message yet, so we're just waiting to hear back from him. We're back in business. Brakes were locked up because one of the little power uh, or wire harnesses came undone. We are back on the road. Oh, there's a bunch of horses. This mare is Craigers. Good sized horse too. Yeah. Hi, oh, Mr. Wiggles. How are you? We're gonna unload the water, and it looks like the brakes are doing good. Then we're gonna grab everything we need, and we're gonna roll back out. If there's any problems, Kevin told us just to bring it over to him. And as a bit of testament, if you will, to how solid KN is, as soon as I messaged and said, hey, the brakes locked up, they're like, if you got someone to tow you, we'll pay everything. So they really, really stand behind their work. I love that shop. These have gotten plenty of sunlight. You can see all the green leaves. So I'm gonna put those in the fridge. And the alfalfa, I think I'm gonna let that green up a little bit more. And those are the ones that I just put out today. Okay. The Highlander is running good again. And if we have any issues, Kevin said, just bring it on by. So far, so good with the brakes. Give him a pincho dude a honk, but he probably won't recognize the car. The brake's locked up again. Last time, this slipped out, and we plugged it back in, and everything was good until we got almost to Walmart. I think it's a loose connection in that wire harness. Oh, wait just locked up again the brakes are starting to tighten up again um we can smell them i can definitely feel them but luckily we have made it here and services and then it started up again when we were i think it's a small problem but we don't know yet taking care of some messages and whatnot waiting on them to finish up like i said i think it's probably something simple and it won't take very long okay it was a couple of adjustments they got that taken care of and we are going to be back on the road in just a minute and i think the first place we're going to go is denny's we're going to get some air conditioning and grub out for a bit need it need it here she comes you. Oh, you're furry and barky. Yes, you are. You seem like a good dog. We are off to Denny's. Um, notice there's a power steering hose that's brittle. It's leaking from the bottom and it's about to go. So they're going to order one. We're going to get that put on. And because the brakes locked up, the pads were, they're getting to the point where we need to change them. They're not there yet, but the um, disc is a little uh, warped. So I'm gonna go ahead and do that, new pads and the new hose um, as soon as the hose comes in. We are now Denny's bound and I'm pretty excited about that. We have arrived at the land of happy junk food and milkshakes. Oh yeah, they serve alcohol at the Denny's here. Just got our order in, car's running perfect. My phone's about to die. We still, we got a ton of running around to do still. Still gotta go to Walmart. Post, post office, office, produce. produce and shoot the shit yeah keys <laughs> keys yeah feast your eyes on that 
Ooh, I'm excited. Ooh. Got brain freeze right off the rip. We're both rocking the burgers for Denny's today. It's almost four. We might be able to get all our stuff done. Um, we're starting off at Walmart phone case. That's the first thing. I screwed up my first coffee. I accidentally added a fruit punch packet to it. And then I let Choco in. And that really, really, really flipped Wiggles and Luna out. Oh, Ben made his bed today. Yeah! I still got a mountain of laundry I have to do. So I think we're gonna use today to do that kind of housework stuff. Chaka, come on, you're coming with me. Bye, Good girl. There's the dogs that got super jealous. Luna actually stuck her head in the door and wouldn't let me shut it. She was like, don't let that little dog inside. Don't let that little Choco dog in. Crashed super early last night. Didn't get that video out. I'm working on that today. It's 4th of July though, and I figured a lot of y'all had stuff going on. So I am gonna get this video out. It's gonna be a little late. And I got myself a non-fruit punch coffee. I'm editing here and I wanted to touch base on the brake issue. The new brake pump that was installed, the plunger on the front of it, was a good bit longer than the old one. And K&N was able to figure that out pretty quick. Um, I would not have figured that out. I would have kept chasing the electrical connection because that's what I thought it was. That's what gave us a little bit of you know positive results initially. Um, so I'm really stoked they got that taken care of because like I said, I would have fought it forever and ever. I never in a million years would have compared the new one to the old one and say, hey, is there something going on here with the new part? Um, they did and like I said, that plunger sticking out the front was a little too long and they were able to adjust it and get it working fine and the brakes are awesome right now i'm gonna go ahead and wrap this video up um there was it's a short video there's a lot of footage i'm missing that i can't find like we went to get keys but the guy doesn't do auto keys um the post office of course all that exciting content um but yeah we're missing all kinds of footage so i'm not sure what the issue is there but that's it on this video it's fourth of july i'm not sure what we're going to do today i think we're going to go to emmanuel and sarah's house maybe eat some burgers and hot dogs and do a bunch of housework today so oh and i got thunder thunder i got some beet pulp i made yesterday yeah you get that today and that's about it love y'all and i'll see you in just a few minutes as soon as we turn this camera back on